Um, in this example, what they're basically asking us to do is to find the midpoint of P and Q. So to find the midpoint of P and Q, basically, ladies and gentlemen, what we need to make sure we know how to do is, first of all, the midpoint formula. So if you do not know the midpoint formula, the midpoint formula, pretty much between any two points, is equal to x1 plus x2 divided by 2, comma, y1 plus y2 divided by 2. Basically, all you're simply doing for the midpoint formula is finding the average distance between the two points. JT, no, what do you, I'm, you're supposed to be writing this. You don't have yours? So when I said who needed one, that would have been a good opportunity for you to say I needed one, right? OK. Here we go. Now you can get all to, up to speed. So basically, now the next thing we need to do is identify, well, what is my x1? What is my y1? Well, it doesn't really matter which ones you want to label. We each know that each, x, each coordinate has an x and a y. Each coordinate point has an x and a y coordinate, correct? So basically, it doesn't matter which one you do. Just make sure you guys label them um, not like that. If you have x1, y1, x2, y2. Don't do x1, y2 in the, for the same coordinate point. Just label them as they are. Now, I can simply just plug them into my equation. So m equals x1, I labeled as 2, plus x2, I labeled as 12, divided by 2, comma, y1 is 3, plus a negative 15, divided by 2. Notice, ladies and gentlemen, when I had that negative, I put it in parentheses. That's going to be the most common mistake that students will make, is they will um, forget that things are negative, and they'll plug it in as is. So make sure you use parentheses, when you're, especially when you're plugging in a negative sign, because that's the most common mistake students will make. Well, 2 plus 12 is going to be 14 over 2, comma, 3 plus negative 15 is negative 12 over 2. 12 divided by 2 is 7. Negative 2 divided by 2 is negative 6. That's negative 12. What did I say? Negative 12. OK. Negative 12 divided by positive 2 is negative 6. Cool. 